Hello everyone! Today we're going to visit the chocolate factory. The name of the chocolate is Lederach uh, because we know that Switzerland is famous of having a good chocolate or the best chocolate. So let's try and check inside and see you later! Okay guys, so we're going inside the factory and let's check. Okay guys, after we showed our receipt because you can pay in advance and online or here directly in cash, they will give you this and two spoon later for trying the chocolate. Okay, now we're going to check the store. <laughs> they have popcorn. the factory fresh chocolate oh so that's how they do it Here you can choose any flavor you want and then they will mix it and then after if you want to write a letter for example you're going to give it for someone special and then you have this the final final product Welcome. I'm very pleased to see you all. My name is Elias Lederoff, and believe me, I've got the best job in the world. Seriously, I love chocolate. You can do so much for it, and you always end up making someone happy. I think that's what drives us all. My own family and our entire chocolate family all around the world. We just love what we do, and so did my grandfather, Dilana. In 1962, he started it all in his small chocolate in the canton of Graus. But eight years later, he invented the whole truffle shell, which he sold to other chocolatiers. He was a brilliant inventor with great passion for chocolate. With the acquisition of Mercur and the introduction of the fresh chocolate brand, our father, Jürgen Lederer, boldly advanced the family business. Their hard work brought us where we are today, and it gave us all this fresh chocolate of the highest quality. That you may wonder, how exactly do we do it? Well, you'll find out. Go and discover the secret behind our precious effort.
I'm Giuliano Sargenti. I'm responsible for product development at Lederach. Today, we will explore the freshness of chocolate with all five senses. We take a piece of chocolate. Important, chocolate is best at room temperature. Now let's look at the chocolate. We see a lovely semi-matte finish and a wonderful brown color. Now we will touch the chocolate and feel the uneven surface. This shows us that it was made by hand. At the same time, it feels smooth and even. Now we listen. We can feel a certain amount of resistance. Click. A deep, clear break. That tells us it's fresh. Now we smell the chocolate. It's clear immediately if chocolate is fresh or not. Fresh chocolate unleashes a wonderful bouquet of scents. The human nose can detect up to 600 different smells. Hazelnut, caramel, a fruitiness, and a wonderful cocoa note. Now we feel how crisp the chocolate is and how wonderfully it melts. When chocolate is fresh, you get a variety of tastes and flavors. Milk, vanilla, cocoa, and a pleasant sweetness. When you bite into the hazelnut, it releases intense roasty flavors, along with caramel and crunch. Lastly, we taste cocoa at the finish. These flavors are much more intense with dark chocolate, which also has more acidity and fruitiness. Chocolate is most flavorful when it is fresh. And now you can enjoy your further journey of discovery and keep all five senses open. Have fun! I'm Edwin Sabawa, a cocoa farmer from Mpala. Our trees bear the cocoa type Trinitario. We harvest about 50 fruits per tree annually on average, yielding around 10 to 11 bars of dark chocolate. We want to operate the farm in such a way that future generations will be able to follow in our footsteps. The friendship with Juan Pablo is important for our cocoa processing. We are constantly sharing our knowledge with each other. I've achieved efficient production through the use of fertilizer that we produce ourselves. We exchange ideas not only with our neighbors, but also with cocoa farmers all over the country. The next steps are the fermentation and the drying of the cocoa. During fermentation, the sugar in the bean turns into alcohol. 
and the fruit juice drains out. De esta manera, allowing the flavors to develop. The duration, heat, and temperature of the beans are key to good fermentation. Drying is just as important as fermentation. In consultation with Ladderac, we work with a very slow and careful process that seals in all the flavors in the beans. We carefully ensure that the beans have a water content of no more than 7% and that their appearance and taste meet the requirements for export to Europe. that I can bring together happy people who make other people happy. This is my dream. That people in other parts of the world will be able to enjoy fruits and products of Costa Rica that have been created in harmony with nature. Nichts. Ja, auch Das Pulver, das wir dann auch noch hier im Video anschauen, das Pulver geht nachher auf dieser Förderbank, auf dem Schwarzen, den ihr hier seht, geht es hinten. Und da, wo ihr die Gitter drauf seht, mit diesen Kopfteinen, das sind die, die sogenannten Ponchen, die ihr vorhin gesehen habt, die nachher blühen und blühen. Oder? Und dort, das geht stundenlang, der Prozess, bis man nachher eine wunderbar flüssige Schoppe hat. Und das ist dann die sogenannte Pulverfülle. Und die wird dann in den Containern, die dort am Boden stehen, die grauen Containern, abgefüllt und dann nach einer Dach los. Und nach einer Dach wird sie nachher zum Produkt gebracht. Das ist der ganze Ablauf, wenn Sie nachher, wenn Sie das dort gerne bewegen, dann können Sie noch fragen, ob Sie etwas noch fragen, dann haben Sie ein paar Minuten noch Zeit. Oder dann das Bild, das Sie da vorne mit an der Wand sehen, so wie Sie das sehen, das gleiche. Dann kommt Stein und Wald. Ja. Ja, after trying the cacao nips, guys, we try the, the press one with sugar and the taste is like this. Creamy. Okay, guys, after trying the cacao beans, now we're trying the cacao juice. The staff said, drink slowly. It's in this game bitter and the cacao flavor is really strong.
Ready to eat. Quality control. Perfect. <laughs> they use these guys for forming the chocolate. Okay guys, I will try the chocolate, milk chocolate. I want more. And let's try. Mm, it's good. It's really good. I want to try other. Mm, it's the same milk chocolate, milk chocolate. Okay, I will try the dark chocolate. Next. Cool. It's not too bitter and it's not too sweet. I like it because I like dark chocolate. What's the other? I think I all have. I don't know. Ah, the milk. White chocolate. Okay, the next flavor I will try white chocolate. Oh my god. I, I. <laughs> mm. It's all good. Mm. I think that's all. Mm. I'm so wrong. But my favorite is the dunkel, the dark chocolate. Smell the chocolate, so I will try. Oh, it smells like berry because it's ras raspberry, blackberry, chocolate. Schön, dass Sie hier waren und nun unser frische Geheimnis kennen. Ganz herzlich willkommen in der Chocolate Family und bis zum nächsten Mal. I'm glad you were here and got to know our secret of freshness. Very welcome to our chocolate family and see you again soon.
different flavor Oh, it's written. This is their new flavor, huh? We have a salted flavor. They have different packaging guys and like this also for special occasion like happy birthday And they have also in the wooden box. It's so long, it's cute. Oh, they have also guys small cake and different flavor. Because here in the factory they have also cafe, but because of Corona it's closed for a meantime but they, you can have also here you can order but just take away this coffee so for the coffee lover okay guys that's the end of my videos for today i hope you enjoy it watching around the chocolate factory and please like and subscribe thank you